Welcome back, everyone. It is Sunday Sit Down Time. We've got Mizzou Gymnastics Coach Shannon Welker in the house for Sunday Sit Down. Thanks for making some time. How have the past few crazy months been for you? Yeah, they've been good. <laughs> we got through a busy recruiting season of on-campus visits, and now we're kind of settling in and focusing on our team. So it's been great. I'm sure this is a fun time of year for you guys where you always get to be together right now. So kind of tell me about this group this year. You know, over the past few months, yeah. what have you learned about this group? Yeah, great. You know, I, I, every year is different, even mm -hmm. if we have a lot of the same people and student athletes on our team. But it's been a lot of fun. And I'm really excited about this team, and, and they bring a, a lot of great talent, and they're a great group of young women. Mm -hmm. yep. well, Identity-wise, what do you feel like, you know, I know that kind of comes out as you go on mm -hmm. into a season, but what do you feel like has the, been the identity a bit of this team? Yeah, you know, every year is different. You right. know, I think we, we, we just, we try to maximize potential. I think that's one thing, but but they're man, they're a fun group, um, you know. And, and kind of selfishly, I always like to. I, I, I really enjoy having people around us that we work with day in and day out that we really like to and that love gymnastics. And this is definitely a group that that does those things. Mm -hmm. Yeah. When you talk about some uh, veteran leadership, there it's having Sienna back has to has to be a yeah. good thing. You know, what has she brought to this team experience wise and all the time she's been with you guys? Yeah, just a calmness. You right. know, and just you know, she's so fun. She I was I was just thinking about her today and mm -hmm. I was like man five years you know four and a half years at this point but she just that she brings it every day just a great attitude the work ethic and in and, um, and she she's definitely the heart and soul of our team and uh, it's exciting to have her back mm -hmm. well bring back to last year you know you go to NCAA regionals again you know, what, what yeah. do you feel like was the biggest takeaway for you last year from what you guys well did? you know we, we ended up in a tough regional mm -hmm. out at UCLA it was it was Utah UCLA Washington and ourselves and we came in third by just a hair and mm -hmm. but we did it in somebody else's house and I feel like on a neutral neutral setting um, might have been a different ball game right there, and um, but but what it told us is that we can compete with the best in the country, home, away, wherever, and uh, and we definitely put in the work to do that. When you see those kind of meets where you are competing against some of the best, right. what are some of the things you can maybe focus in and on the off season and say these yeah. are the areas that we need, we need to improve in? Yeah, we're we're always looking for. You know, we're at a point now where it's really about the details. Like ninety percent of what we do is pretty much the same every year, and it's just like that last ten percent. Right. But I just think some little details here and there. We're, we're right there. It's so minimal, and mm -hmm. um, it's just kind of getting over that hump. And every year, it's just we get a little higher, a little higher, a little higher. And so I'm excited to see what our team can do this year. Right. Well, I was just going to ask you about uh, the next step. Obviously, the next step mm -hmm. is NCAA championships. That's right. where you'd like to go. But for you as a program, what do you feel like is that next step you want to see? Yeah, that, I think that's definitely it. You know, we mm -hmm. talk about uh, there's no defense in gymnastics. Right. So we so we just talk about what we can control in those things and process and, mm -hmm. and a lot of that stuff. So it really is, I feel like, you know, every year we want to, you know, the outcome stuff, we want to be a winning, we want to have a winning record in the SEC. Mm -hmm. uh, we want to position ourselves to go back to NCAA championships again. We did that two years ago. We were right there last year. I feel like we can do it this year. Um, but, it, you know, really for us, it comes down to just those small details and, and just keeping some people healthy, too, and, and um, you know, and just keep keeping things moving forward. Right. Those yep. small details, yep. so important in SEC yes. gymnastics specifically. Yep. SEC, I mean, what a conference it's come, become, right. you know, over the years. In your time here, have you seen this conference go? I feel like year after year we Man. talk about this, but it, it gets better yeah. every year. <laughs> it's, it's tough. I mean, we have eight teams in the SEC, and every year they're in the top 25, mm -hmm. all eight teams. I, I don't think any other conference can claim that year right. in and year out and mm -hmm. so it's you know if you have a winning record in the SEC you're probably top 10 in the country mm -hmm. um, and so yeah but it's it's great you know it, for us it's just you know it's it's landing sticking landings and mm -hmm. just uh, hitting handstands and just all those little bitty things and those are the difference makers and they add up over the game mm -hmm. well I want to talk you're opening yeah. up the season on uh, December 10th you're gonna have an exhibition out at the at the Hearn Center right. there you know kind of tell us a little bit about that that's a fun opportunity for fans to come out and see yeah that. absolutely uh, so Sunday, December 10th at 1 p.m., we've got uh, an open to the public. It's free. Mm -hmm. um, and if you've never been to a gymnastics meet, this is a great time. And you just see Mizzou Gymnastics and just see how talented and how fun. It's fast-paced, hour and a half. You're in, you're mm -hmm. out. You're on with your day, but you just saw something really cool. So, mm -hmm. um, but I think it'd be a great opportunity for fans to, that have seen it to come back. But new, new, if you've never seen a gymnastics meet, this would be a great opportunity. I feel like you guys have more and more fan support every time. I mean, every time I go out yeah. there, it keeps building over the years. You know, what have you seen it grow? Like? Well, I think we've been consistently mm -hmm. uh, competitive, and right. I think that's what it <laughs> takes to build a fan base, right? And so, um, but we've got great support, obviously, from our administration, and they're putting a lot of effort into the fan engagement piece, as we see in other sports. 
mm -hmm. but they're doing it in gymnastics as well. And so, but I do, uh, we've had some, a little, uh, some open inter, uh, practices in our gym. Mm -hmm. I think we have about 300 people there a couple yeah. of weeks ago. They just came in and, and uh, on that. So I'm excited to see what our fans are going to help us be able to do this year as well. Well, I've been asking uh, every Mizzou coach I've talked about the momentum that you've yeah. seen. I know that's the, the word they're using, yeah. right, is the momentum. Talk about the time it is to be involved in Mizzou athletics right now. Yeah. It feels like things are just kind of picking yeah. up. <laughs> yeah, it's, it really is fun, and I'm sure it's fun for anybody in the, who's a Mizzou fan, mm -hmm. right? And maybe even on you guys from the media right. standpoint, too. There's a lot of fun stuff to cover. But, yeah, it's so exciting. I think, I think what we've done and what Desiree has helped us do is just unite the, 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 the coaching staffs from mm -hmm. all sports, and I think uh, that's united the community and just – and we can do some great things. And, you know, we talked about on our team all the time. Listen, we may not on paper, it may look like we're outmatched, but if we outwork, we out heart, and we out team, we can do it, and we can do that as an athletic department as well. So it's mm -hmm. been really fun. Well, two girls I've always seen have a lot of heart since I've known them there is Amari and Jocelyn. They, yeah. They've always been really fun to watch. You know, tell me the growth that you've seen from them, both of them yeah. now juniors this year, right? Yes, yeah, so, <laughs> so much, so much confidence. I'm excited. If you if you haven't watched those two young ladies, mm -hmm. they're impressive, and, and I think they're going to do some great things. They're set up right now to have an incredible their their best year yet and they're just ju you know they're juniors mm -hmm. and they're definitely leaders on our team and i'm excited for those young ladies mm -hmm. yeah. uh, the schedule this year how do you how do you like how it lays out some fun road trips there you go to yeah. athens tuscaloosa i saw lexington too you know how do you like how that yeah yeah we us? we've got a, a little bit of a tougher road road uh schedule this year mm -hmm. but I, we feel like those are opportunities for us and if we can do well on the road we can that really helps pave the way for our rankings and it helps us out towards the end of the year but but yeah some exciting stuff we always we have we call this our tour of alabama we go down mm -hmm. to Auburn. We go to, we go to um, Auburn as well, and then we go to Georgia, and then um, I forget we're at one other one there. I think mm -hmm. Kentucky. So, right. so we've got some really cool stuff, but we're also doing a really cool Zoo to the Lou in St. Louis That's this right. year. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we moved our Florida meet there. Um, and our athletic department was awesome. They helped us kind of get it arranged, and we've got it. It's a podium meet, which is okay. an elevated meet, which is really a fun thing for fans. So, so a lot of cool stuff. Mm -hmm. But yeah, great, great road schedule this year, and we're excited about it. Right. Well, you know, it's gonna it's gonna be fun to watch this year. I appreciate you making yeah. some time for us before it all gets crazy for you guys. Yes. Well, <laughs> we appreciate it. Thanks for having us. Yep. For the rest of you guys, we'll be right back after the break.